well off the top vertically. They convert really well off each other. And they're a team on the rise in Chicago. Let's see what they can do against Big Mac Sage. So I know what Big Mac Sage are going to want is to avoid stages that they can kill off the top. So mm -hmm. they're not going to want to see. Well, they also kill off the top. Don't forget. Right. But avoiding, I think avoiding it is better. It benefits Red Team a little more. Yeah, definitely. It's Meta Knight's conversions off the top of the stage can be just kind of insane. So you have to be very careful where you counterpick and where you neutral. So it looks like uh, we're hovering over FD, but like the Omega Palutena's will be the gentleman instead. They don't want to mess with any uh, crazy transitions. Right. And that, you know, that might be what dooms uh, Umbra Clock Tower. Have you seen those? The the dragon comes in and is just like. It's just so cool. You can't not look at it. I mean, it's not blinding. It's just really cool. <laughs> I, I've already I've taken percent from just being distracted by a dragon before. But we are getting into this game. So uh, both teams on the respective sides. Moniker digging in a little bit deeper. Dark Pit's team rocking out. And Tyra, he's frontlining really hard here. It looks like uh, Anonymous Moniker, he's going to be the one who kind of plays the back line a little more. It's just interesting. You kind of usually see, we saw like the opposite here with the, from the JJ Demitis team, where JJ kind of frontlined and then Tyra just convert, or not Tyra, Demitis just converted with his up airs and up Bs off right. of grab. But it looks like they want to do the opposite here. And Tyra going for a Gimp, but that bomb will save Sage. Yep. Good, good recovery. Tyra team killing Luma. I think Mac is trying to cover as much space as he can because he's Sheik, and that's what Sheik does in doubles. Kind of just stage controls everything. Especially for slower characters like Rosalina. Sage always making sure he's got a bomb on deck. He was looking for a boomerang there, doesn't actually have it. Pretends are looking really clean, really even right now. Yeah, it was, a, it was a bit of a scramble, but right now everybody's just re retreated to this neutral. See some one-on-ones right now. Monica looking for a reboot up smash, not gonna get anything. Ooh, bomb oh. confirmed. Yup, that's so strong. And Sage, gonna take out Tyra's first stock. That's first blood here in this winner's round three match. That's like a peach quality forward air right there. <laughs> It's just as strong. Maybe stronger. And there he's going to get a second KO. That's going to be it. I was talking about this with Sage. Like, just the nature of his team comp is going to be Toon Link getting five kills a game. Right. Toon Link has so much kill power, especially if you have these confirms labs. And it really, like, the bomb confirms are so strong, it kind of lets you play this 1v1 game. Right. Tyra's fishing really hard right now for an upbeat. He's gone for two or three of those. Missed. Yeah, we got blue team. A good rage right now. If they can keep it, that's big. Oh, but that's going to be a good kill here for Tyra with that read on the down B. Oh, the dagger spike just enough. Wow, he just got the the downwards knock back from the uh, just the first couple of hits before the last one even hit. The semi spike. Right. That'll even up these stocks. And the percent, they're in a little bit of a hole, but you know these. Little man. deficits can just disappear quickly. He's gonna get that ladder. And see, that's the thing about doubles, though. Mm -hmm. Big Mac, Big Mac, well aware of what's happening to his teammate. Yeah, very good awareness of Big Mac. And now here's Rosalina's wall. Good job there by Tyroid, making sure he uh, ledge canceled his up beat. But, oof. Monger losing the second stock. gonna take another stock there. Woo! Yeah, yeah, oh my go. god. Another one. Four stocks already, like you said. <laughs> Tyroid overextended a little bit too much, oh, but, but he will land that forward smash. That's a Tyroid special right there. So that might force me. I told him, that's why you got sponsored, man. <laughs> <laughs> the Mennonite forward smash. It's so strong, it's so safe, it's such a powerful punish. <laughs> Tyroid now, he's just trying to keep Big Mac off the stage. Yeah, yeah, and he gets the back air, but he oh. fast falls! Oh no! Now we gotta see Rosa in a 1v2. 2v2 counts Luma. <laughs> that's a tough task. Yeah, it really is. She's so light, and we got two in lane with the damage. The bomb confirms. Mm. This is actually a really hard team to 1v2. Um, Sheik is, just covers so much space and is so <laughs> oppressive in the, the neutral. The boomerang just killing Luma. <laughs> Sheik is so oppressive in the neutral here. Which allows Sage to just play back and then go for just one hit. And that's all he needs to kill. And I see, I see in the way these guys, I mean, uh, Sage and Big Mac, they like to uh, ledge guard. They got their needles, they got the bombs, they got the boomerangs. 
There we go. He gets bombed to backwards, boomerang to forward smash. I want to see this KO count. Down. What is it, six? Probably. No, no. No, it's five and an SD. But then, five and an SD. But uh, you still get the damage on him, though. Oh, I'm sure. No, I think damage usually ends up being pretty even for both players. No, did he? Uh, did but he Sage had did, five did, KOs. Did, did, did he uh, SD at zero? No, no, it was five and then Tyra's SD. Yeah, no, did Tyra SD at zero, though? Because if he even takes one percent, it's no, a he, KO. Is it? Well, yeah, they give you first. Yeah, it's but it's he SD'd killing Sheik, so I think that Sheik might have gotten the yeah, claim true, for, yeah. the, for the SD. So, definitely five on the count of uh, Mikey Beach there in his uh, classic V neck. Gotta see if Tyra's gonna consider a switch or not. Yeah, home team going up a game. Um, Tyro, he might. They lose, they lose the kill power, so we'll see what he ends up deciding. Oh no. Yeah, we're not gonna see any DLC. I think it's too much on the line. We're not gonna see blue team switch. I hate you so much right now, Monica. Big Mac staying. Okay, I think, I think everyone's gonna stay. I think everyone's gonna stay characters. We're not gonna see any switches. Um, we might go to uh, we might go to a lower ceiling. We'll see though. I literally cannot handle the noise that Monica's making right now, so I'm taking off my headphones. Is he, uh, what's, what's, he, what's he got? Oh yeah, it's like Little Princess Zelda figure, I think. That he carries oh, he's Tyroi. got a Zelda? Yeah. That's his waifu, I think. Tyra does play, I think, every single Zelda character. To some degree. Uh, the stage is going to end up being Dreamblade, it looks like. We'll see. So let's see if they can make use of that lower ceiling. Uh, of course, Big Mac likes right, to use the two. Game two. Three, yeah, this is a good one, counter pick here for the red go. team. But we, okay, we do have the Sheik. We did see the Sheik switch. Double Sheiks. And then who's going to convert better for their teammates? Is it going to be Rosalina or is it going to be Toon Link? They want to get that kill power out of there. So they want to get Toon Link out. And the Rosalina Toon Link matchup actually is really weird. Because Toon Link can kill Rosalina really easily. That's a good hitbox to convert off of. But oh my goodness, this percent right now. Tyra playing very clean at a low 90%. And Monica not doing too bad either. This is a lot like Tyra's last set on screen. Like literally, he, he didn't take like percent for like a minute. Mm -hmm. And right now, uh, Rosalina is just one crown away from taking the sock. Now Luma's back. Okay, good down air. Not, you know, Tyra should have gone for a back throw there to his teammate. He was definitely fishing there. Yeah. One thing that can happen when you play Sheik and Delve is you get into a little bit of singles mode where you forget to do team converts. And that's what you see from very high level Sheiks like Mr. R and uh, Zero. They always remember that it's doubles. And they always remember to go for these team conversions. Because your teammate's there to make up for your weakness, which is you don't have as much kill power. Oh. That's so close. Dead Luma. But he extends a little too far and back here takes him. And now, this is a little tricky here for, uh, for the blue team. They have retreated back to the neutral. But now Sage is stuck on the top platform. He will make it down. Bouncing fish. Bouncing off Luma. Hitting Tyroy. That bouncing fish, man. It's a move. And I think they do want. I think they want to split up the sheiks. I don't think they want the mirror head. Tyroy, how did he miss his recovery? They needed that stock too. Yeah, that's huge here for blue team. And if the longer that Sage can hold on to his stock, the better they're looking, man. Footstool, nothing. Okay, nothing tricky out of the footstool here. Now we're seeing Sage with Max Rage, not looking good. Sage with Rage. 150% on Toon Link is actually. Oh my goodness! Oh, that up air. Monica looking good, and he gets the up air there. Now it is three stocks to five. And he's taunting. He's feeling good. That and is he's a mistake. Pay for that. <laughs> Taunt to get bodied combo. Taunt to get bodied. True combo confirmed on stream. Monica wanted to show how appreciative he was of his awareness in doubles. I mean, they're definitely up in stock still, so. And they're, they're up a clean stock. These percents are looking good for them. But it would be two stocks. Big Mac showing him he don't taunt here. <laughs> yeah, don't don't do any of that. Seems to now Rosa basically kill percent right now. Yeah, this is kill percent versus Toon Link. You have to be very careful, when, especially when you're at that edge. And 
Sage looking for the spike, not gonna get it. Good awareness there by Tyra to get out of that fort tonight. Just teammate. You know, Tyra, he's looking like a new man right now. He's doing a lot of work. Okay, no back air there. Ooh, uh, forward air. That will even up these stocks. Tyra looking for a Vanish Reed, not gonna get it. And here comes a bunch of forward airs from Big Mac trying to just get this stage back. Yeah, all these cheeks vanishing all over each other. <laughs> and he just catches him with the shield poke, stock lead back in favor of blue team. So uh, Big Mac's gotta hold this dive. So does Chun Link. He's actually Ooh, tries to get the uh, roll get up. If Big Mac holds the stock, they're in great shape. Right. And you see him here. He's just playing at the edge, just waiting for a roll to grab. He's just gonna keep playing conservatively. Tyra playing extra safe. Oh, I like that bouncing fish. But good awareness to get out of it by the blue team. Ooh, Back air for that. out. Chair stock coming in. I'm not sure has rage. I'm not sure we're going to see that. <laughs> but then again, the 1v2 would have been way worse. But there's the bouncing fish, and, and now, now it's Sheik. It's going to be really hard for Big Mac to get combo confirms. Yeah, it's going to be so hard. Sheik does well in 2v1s. But do you do two one well in two v ones in the mirror? Oh, he's going for that fish. <laughs> We're gonna see the. Oh, gonna, oh no! Oh, saving your teammate. Oh, save your wow. wow! That was beautiful by Tyroway. You took some percent for it, but you take that yeah. for the stock. Easily, easily. Easy trade. Big Mac, not making it easy for them. And there, Tyroway perfectly covering that bouncing fish option, knowing it was coming out from Big Mac. Red team really wants this game through. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Ooh, that would have looked clean. That would have been so nice. Oh, man, they work on this stuff, man. Look at that. You can tell. <laughs> they're, they're going for a lot of it. They're not far off. And they're... Mm, I would have actually just liked the up smash, I think. If your teammate was at 76, it wouldn't have killed him. Cover safely on stage. You know, there's so many team combos you can do that look so cool. But sometimes just grab them and then run up and up smash. Right. And it's not pretty. You might kill your teammate, but it's a 2v1. Just do it. I think I can just get one of these guys out of here. He yeah, really jab, jab, bad. grab will kill Big Mac at this Ooh, point. Ooh, Rosa. Yeah, Luma stopping, in, stopping the uh, bouncing fish. This is such a tough situation for Big Mac. He's got to come up with... He is putting the percent on, though. So he's really one up air away from taking out one of these characters with this rage. If Ooh, he's over. Trump. Now he's got no invincibility. He's going to have a hard time getting the deck on. If Red Team keeps toying with their food a little bit too much, Tyra might be able, or I'm sorry, Big Man might be able to sneak this one out. Right. He's a Vanish read away. He's an up air away. All right. Ooh, that's it. Oh, uh, I'm surprised. I honestly just smashed both of them at that point. Up smash, yeah. Oh, well, he's going to get the trump to back air. So we're going to see a game three. That was Ty honestly a little bit closer than it should have been. <laughs> Tyra is showing like no emotion. He's like, I do this all the time. <laughs> Of course. Tyra is very, very clean player, sponsored by our own events to compete. Glad he was able to make it out. It was a two-plus-hour drive from Urbana Champagne for these guys. Right. So I'm glad they're able to compete. Yeah, I think they brought a car with Moniker and a uh, Manly guy. So. Oh, Manly guy's here? Yep. Oh, I love that guy. He's great. He's Manly. Where's he at? <laughs> yeah, he's a Manly guy. Plays like Donkey King Kong and Ganondorf. Manly characters. <laughs> he's a Manly guy. All over, all in all, pretty Manly. Scale 1 to 10, he's manly. <laughs> I'm glad we have this this camera here so we can see all of the Yeah, we, so we got the ca uh, car from their school. We got the car from Michigan. S car from Michigan, car from St. Louis. Michigan's here to promote uh, Frostbite next weekend. It's actually a fun time. It's part of the Midwest Circuit. It's going to be freaking off the hizzy. The second Midwest Circuit event. I, I am going to mention it to you specifically, the Low Tier Hero Award. Oh, yeah. You're going, you're gunning for that. He's like, uh, is it like G tier? Rickles, or like Mr. J tier. Yeah, right. It's E tier? No, F tier or lower. F tier or lower, and then you get a $50 bonus if you are the highest placing low tier. Yeah, for each game. So that applies for melee as well. But if Technique's going, that's going to be hard because Technique's been doing really well today. And he's DDD, so. Yeah. Uh, I don't know but if he can again, make I it. I haven't asked him yet. Right. Smash feels a counter pick. Um, really good stage for Toon Link in particular. I like this counter pick a lot for the blue team. Um, if you can get them stuck in shield over on the platform. We haven't actually seen Sage kill with a back throw. Oh, yeah, that's um, right. But do not forget, Toon Link has the second strongest back in the game. Right. And Smashville can lead to really silly 
kills oh, yeah. with those kill throws. Those directional ones, particularly. So this is huge. Yeah, I'm surprised. I don't see a whole lot of grass. I'm just like a lot of, a lot of bombs, which is well, so great. Well, you see how committal Sage's grab is. That's yeah. why you don't see it. Especially versus a Sheik. Like, you're, you're gonna you're gonna die if you whiff a grab against Rosalina at high percent, and at low percent, you're gonna take 40. Right. So you have to be very careful That's when you good. utilize it. Um, these percents pretty even right now. Big Mac will outlier at three three digits in percent. He's caught in this this jab. Oh, I love that. Back so it's a very strong first stock for everybody right now. Yeah, Everyone this is super even. This is evened up. Yeah, very we're winners round three. They're definitely getting closer. Every match is getting closer and closer. Oh, you gotta watch out. Okay, yeah. See, this is a tricky. Getting stuck on this platform is very tricky here for. Uh, Monica against Toon Link. You have to watch out. There's a lot of bombs in the air. Oh, no convert. Tyra falling out beautifully. Ooh, oh, he gets nice. the lunar landing there. Very beautiful convert. Ooh. And that's a trade you take, though, for Sage. And uh, seriously, how long? How much longer is Rosen going to hang in there? Just one good read. 127. Oh, yeah. There's another oh. read from. But beautiful I'm, convert. That's off of Toon Link's bomb thrown by Tyra. Right? Right. And then a uh, two link. Oh, there we go. But we got. But everything say, squares up. Two link lost his rage, but that's still not enough to take Rosa's stock at high percent. Yeah, two link's kill power, man. That's why two link made it into the mid tiers on this latest uh, tier list. Right, and he got some buffs this patch too. Mm -hmm. Oh, he did get buffs. His back air has less knockback or net less landing lag. Right. A lot of other good stuff for two link. All right, this is a good patch for a lot of characters that don't get seen a lot. Like Falco too. He got some good stuff. Mars. Martha, yeah, Fire Emblem Mart's characters. apparently insane now. Like, all the Fire Emblem characters except for, like, uh, Robin got buffs. Mm -hmm. Back in this game, uh, still, again, like, just like Robin the first got stock. crazy buffs last patch, though. Okay. Yeah, just like just like the first stock, it's even. Second stock, it's just yeah. as even. It's like, literally, this is game three, dead even, all across the board. This is a this is a very competitive set. Anything can happen, folks. And right now, stage control is very even. Okay, red team's going to rest it back. Yeah. Stage making his way back on. Very good mix-ups on his landing by Sage. Ooh. Did not want to get for that second forward smash. Yeah, you wanted to watch out. Smart by Sage there. Oh, and he's going to throw out that Zare. Get Bait out of a punish and then up smash. Ooh, he's going to use that bouncing fish, though. Let's on Sage. Ooh, you, yeah, you can't, you can't vanish, bait, vanish. <laughs> oh, and there's the up smash. They're, they must have hurt us. <laughs> Finally, just a like, grab to up smash. And there's going to be forward air there. This is so scary. Ooh, Sage Ooh. With the aerial, man. Look at that presence by Sage. Very strong. But he's got to hold that stock as long as he can. It's a balloon, though. The longer he holds it, the more effective it is. Oh, yeah, there's a trap here. You can't let Big Mac in these uh, 2v1s, uh, these combos. You, you need to play a little campy with Toon Link, but you can't play two campy and doubles, because if you do, then you leave your teammate just kind of out to dry. And Rosalina Sheik can convert. Making you convert really hard. A oh, nice lunar landing there to dodge that bomb. Do you think at 165? Okay, neutral yeah, air is going to do it. And these stocks have even up once again. A couple of rolls from the Sheiks. And Tyroy is the outlier here. He's at a very high percent. He's got to play very, very passive. Unless they can find a way in. And that's Ooh. actually going to be the stock. Toon Link has so much kill power. And it's oh, going to be Rosalina versus a very challenging 1v2 once yeah. again. And she's a kill percent. And the spike! Yeah, like that, the spike. That's the first time I've ever seen that happen. That's great. Mike's been fishing for that a little bit, and he finally lands one. Rosalina's head pokes out of the stage a little bit there on that recovery with That's the uppy. Just what they needed right there. I think he's laughing at probably his kill count. He probably had six KOs. KOs yeah. <laughs> and that's going to be the set. Um, that was a good set. Very well played there by... The home team squeaking out a game three win.